You are my rock, my safe haven, and my forever. From the first time I met you. Whoa. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Maybe I do need to show. <laughs> Michael, I cannot believe we finally made it, our wedding day. I have never been happier than when I'm with you. I can tell you anything. You know me better than anyone else in this world, and somehow, you still manage to love me. I am so lucky to have found someone as genuine as you. You're my very best friend, and you're the best daddy to Elena. You always keep me grounded. I am so excited to spend forever with you. I love you forever and always. Love, Natalie. To my bride on our wedding day. Natalie, I hope you're prepared for today. I think I am, but I know I'm not. I want to tell you I'm so glad we're here today. I love you unconditionally and I'm glad we can celebrate with friends and family. I love you, we make a great team, and I can't wait to spend the rest of our lives together. Enjoy this wedding gift. <laughs> it complements your beautiful skin tone, gorgeous eyes, and beautiful brown hair. 2020 has been a great year, and I love, um, and I'm looking forward for the future decades with, with you. Love, your husband. Natalie, first off, just want to say how much I love you and how I cherish you. <laughs> and how I cherish the time we have together. You're a person I can always depend on, that I trust, and want to spend the rest of my days with. I love all the last second weekend getaways we go on as well, whether that's to the beach, to the cabins, or, or Disney. Um, you've always guided me where and when I need it most, and I always believe in my big promises that we've been able to fulfill recently. You make me a better person, and I can't thank you enough for it. Twenty twenty has been a rough year for many, although I feel like it's been our biggest year yet. Our beautiful daughter is smart, healthy, beautiful, unspoiled, just like you. <laughs> You've graduated your second degree in nursing and will soon be working at another children's hospital wherever we live. We start a new chapter with starting my my business, and here we are getting married. Nothing can hold us back, and we're the best team. I love you for it. I vow to always love you through sickness and health, through the good and the bad, and through the rich and the poor. I vow to always pick up your Coke can, Propel bottle, G2 <laughs> bottle, Chick-fil-A sweet tea, and three other open drinks I find around the house. I vow to always support you no matter what hurdles come over our way. I vow to always forget our plans until the last second. I vow to continue to support this family the best way I can and in every way. I vow to take the mental, emotional, and monetary stress of yearly and sometimes quarterly Disney trips and vacations. I vow to guide you through the Disney parks since somehow you still can't read a map and don't have it memorized <laughs> by scenery. I vow to remember that we are both human and will make mistakes from time to time. 
I vow to continuously work harder to make our relationship the best it can be. I promise to love you until my last breath, protect you from harm, and to comfort you in times of need. And I vow to always beat you at Wednesday night bingo when we're both cranky old people in the senior citizen home. <laughs> you make me a better person and I want to spend the rest of my life with you. Michael, I vow to be with you always and to care for you and to love you and cherish you no matter how far apart we may be. I'll be with you in your heart and always keep you safe in mind when you're sad or mad mostly. I promise to make you smile. I will always support your endeavors and be your cheerleader. I vow to encourage you to continue growing as a person while we work towards our goals. I promise to be patient, understanding, and kind. I promise to give you love, honesty, trust and commitment, and in general, keep your life as interesting as possible as we grow together. I vow always to make our family's love and happiness my priority. I'll be yours in plenty and in want, in sickness and in health, in failure and in triumph. You're my best friend, my confidant, my greatest challenge. But most importantly, you're the love of my life, and you make me happier than I ever thought was possible. You have and continue to make me my dreams come true. You have made me a better and definitely more patient person. <laughs> you know me better than anyone else in this world and you still manage to love me. You're my person, <laughs> my love, and my life today and always. I love you. Now, what comes next is one of the ancient traditions as well, and that is the reading of the ketubah. Now, many went ask, what is a ketubah? It is an ancient wedding document that we've been using for thousands of years. I'm going to bring it forward. It can also be a piece of art. And as you can see, they have chosen a beautiful one. It is in either Aramaic or Hebrew and can be translated into the language of the land. However, there still is a requirement, as we all know, that the groom must translate the Aramaic perfectly into English or else the wedding is invalid. <laughs> that was a joke. <laughs> That's not happening.